In this video, we'll learn how to terminate Legrand's unshielded field terminated modular plug. Legrand carries two different categories of the unshielded field term plug, a category 6, backward compatible with category 5E, and a category 6A plug. The installation steps are the same for both, so in this video we're using the category 6 slash 5E plug. Now let's look at how to differentiate the two. The bottom of the category 6A plug is blue and the wiring cap is white with an angled wiring guide cut, while the category 6 5E plug is solid black on the bottom and has a gray wiring cap with a straight edge wiring guide. It's important to use the proper cap with the proper category plug. The wiring guide comes with instructions for both T568A and B wiring. In today's video, we're going to be covering the T568B guide, which shows white, green, green, brown, white, brown, which will be inserted through the holes on the bottom row of the wiring cap. White, orange, orange, white, blue, blue will be laid into the slots on the top of the wiring cap. There are no special tools needed to complete the termination. All you'll need are a pair of cable strippers, pliers, small diagonal cutters, and of course your plug and cable. We recommend keeping the supplied instruction sheet handy in case you need to reference it during the termination. You're ready to start the termination. Using your strippers, strip about an inch or two of your cable's jacket. Then, spread your pairs back. This will expose any spline that's in the cable. Trim any spline so that it's flush with the cable's jacket. Now, untwist your pairs and straighten out any bends in the wire. Identify the four wires that are going to be laced through the holes on the bottom of the wiring cap. Trim those wires at an angle. That'll make it easier to insert through the slots. After the wires are laced through the holes, slide the wiring cap as close to the cable jacket as possible. Lay the remaining conductors into the top row of the wiring cap, according to the indicated color code. Next, trim your wires as flush as possible with the wiring cap. Proper alignment of the wiring cap in the plug housing is critical for a successful termination. Rotate the wiring cap assembly so it's upside down and seated on the plug housing. Using your pliers, clamp the wiring cap down until it completely sets into place on the plug. Be careful not to use too much force, which could damage the plug. You'll be able to see the wiring cap seat in the plug as you're clamping with the pliers. Once the wiring cap is properly seated, you can tear away the wiring label from the assembly. Now you can close the plug cover. You should hear a snap when you squeeze it shut. 